Hey guys, Richard here with eBike Reviews and Adventures. I got an important update for you about the Edmotor E310 I think you'll be interested in. But before we get into that, I got a special message for Neil. So Neil, if you're watching this video, make sure you stick around to the end for that very special message for you. All right, guys, so here's the deal. Uh, wasn't planning on releasing a video today, but two things came about. One, uh, the, the weather is still kind of decent, so the hurricane hasn't reached us yet. Uh, so I thought, you know, maybe uh, make a video and I got a very special message from Neil to me uh, last night And so I thought yeah, it's warranted. I need to get this information out. So here we go All right guys, so if you remember I released a video talking about the Edmotor E310 brand new trike kind of comparing it with the electric XP and you know that that trike hasn't been released yet So it's only available uh, for pre-order so all we could do is go over the specs online as the manufacturer has provided them. So we did that. We did a tabletop. We went through. We talked about the trike. I told you the things I liked, the things that I didn't care for. or What it came down to, there was really only one thing that I had a concern with, and that was the width of the trike. Now, Neil, pay special attention here. They had the, adv they had the trike advertised as 26 inches, okay? 26 inches. That's pretty narrow. I mean, that's smaller than the electric XP, smaller than all the other trikes, and 26 inches is, you know, makes me think like it's, it's going to be real tippy, right? And so we talked about that, and I said that is a concern, as it should be. So, interesting thing, guys. So last, uh, let's see, Sunday night, Sunday night, two nights ago, um, Sunday night I got a message from AdMotor, and they said, hey, Richard, check this out. Um, we made a mistake. In fact, let me read you the message exactly and i'll put it up on the screen for you as well it says hey richard the e310 pre-sales are going better i asked him about how things were going okay he continues by saying we'll check with my colleague uh for the shipping time and keep you updated then he goes on and volunteers some information here he says and i noticed someone talked about the 26 inch total width of the e310 is too narrow we found that it is a measure mistake the correct width is 29 inches hey guys great news right the correct width of the E310 is going to be 29 inches. The XP trike, I believe, is 30 and a half. So we're talking now the E310 is only going to be an inch and a half more narrow. So that alleviates a lot of concern that I had. And it, seriously, it was the number one concern I had. And I almost didn't pre-order it just because I'm trying to envision in my head this really narrow trike and how, how tippy it's going to be. And so now knowing that it's a few inches wider than that, and it's going to add, I know it's going to add to the stability, that really, that helps me out a lot. That makes me feel so much better knowing that that happened. Now, guys, that information came out Sunday evening, and I wanted to get it out to you on Monday, but I couldn't because I already mentioned, you know, we're prepping for Hurricane Idalia around here, and Monday was a pretty busy day for us. You know, we had to secure things outside, clear the patio, patio furniture, and buy some last minute supplies and you know you know how that kind of thing goes right so i couldn't get that information out to you fast enough and i apologize but thankfully a viewer came along uh, monday night and said hey richard um let's take a look at what he said it's 29 inches wide i've seen you get numbers wrong on both of these trikes in two different videos and that's a terrible disservice to your audience that wants to learn you really need to and I'm going to stop it right there because you get the idea. So Mr. Neal here was pretty upset that, you know, I got the numbers wrong and that I was being a disservice to all of you folks. And you know what? Here's the deal, Neil. I am a little dyslexic and sometimes you will hear me say something stupid on this channel. I can't help that. That's just how it goes. And if I was going to correct every mistake that I made, I would never get a video out because I'd be constantly editing and redoing videos. So you're just gonna have to deal with that just a little bit for me, okay? Also, something else for you to know, I typically don't get personal, but I'm gonna get personal with you right here. I'm a veteran and I have a brain injury and I have PTSD, so that drives a lot of issues for me as well. You get my drift? Okay, so sometimes my cognitive ability just isn't where it needs to be. I'm the first to admit that sometimes my spark plug isn't firing correctly. I have good days and I have bad days, and that's just how it's going to be. But let's get back to this 26 inch versus 29 inch. So Neil, if you had watched my video properly and carefully and listened to what I said and checked out the video right here, I'm gonna put an image up on the screen for you, right here on the website, 
they clearly listed that it was a 26 inch strike. So it wasn't me getting this wrong, Neil, it was the website, it was AdMotor that made the mistake by advertising it as a 26 inch strike. But after they sent that message to me on Sunday evening, they probably went out there and made the correction on the website right away because I went out there after receiving that, that email and checked myself just to see if they had updated it. And voila, looky there, it now says it's a 29 inch trike. So they got it correct. Now, Neil, here's the thing, buddy. So I know you're trying to do a good thing by just saying, hey, you know what? Uh, that information was wrong and you could have said it that way and everything would have been good. But your approach was completely inappropriate and unwarranted by the personal attack that you made because it feels like a personal attack, Neil, because the way you came at me telling me that I'm a disservice and how I was wrong and I won't get, I'm not going to get into all the other things you said. That was completely inappropriate. And for those reasons, I don't need you on this channel. You're gone.